Good evening. I'm Erica Sargent. Great to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlin. Today, Illinois' top attorney released a report detailing the results of a five-year investigation into sexual abuse within the Catholic Church. The 696-page report names 451 clerics and religious brothers who have been credibly accused of abusing children. Before today, the Catholic Diocese of Illinois had only acknowledged 103. The report also identified nearly 2,000 victims. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey is in the news room digging into the staggering numbers. This report reveals names and very detailed information about 451 Catholic clerics and religious brothers across the state who abused nearly 2,000 children over the course of about 70 years. And Attorney General Raul says that is a much larger number than the public knew about. Each Illinois diocese underreported the number of child sex abusers in the Catholic clergy when they initially released those numbers to the public. Attorney General Raul's voice was filled with emotion as he explained his office's findings. He said the investigation was difficult not only because of the painful nature of the allegations, but also because of the fact that he was raised Catholic. My mother was a faithful, practicing Catholic for the entirety of her life. The more than four-year investigation into claims of sex abuse by clergy covered seven decades. The report publicly identifies 451 Catholic clerics and religious brothers. Raul says 330 of them are now deceased. While each of the six Illinois dioceses have reported lists of known abusers, Raul raised alarms that... There are still 149 clerics that the... Um, Dioceses do not disclose, that our report discloses. There is no undisclosed name whatsoever. There's no cover up, no hiding whatsoever. Cardinal Blaise Supich, speaking only on behalf of the Archdiocese of Chicago, said the discrepancy has to do with clerics from different dioceses, religious order clerics, and lay brothers, the records of which they do not have access to. We don't have the, uh, uh, the freedom that the state does to go in and take the files of, of a group. And so we have we have, we don't uh, put them on our list because we can't substantiate them. Raul's office reviewed more than 100,000 pages of records and received 600 confidential contacts from survivors during the investigation. Cardinal Supich reiterated that none of the identified abusers are in ministry today. That said, they'll be reviewing the list and lengthy recommendations made by the AG's office. The reality of child sex abuse does not end with this report. In the Archdiocese of Chicago, the report identified 275 abusive clerics and religious brothers. In the newsroom, Megan Hickey, CBS 2 Investigators.